This is the second video you should be watching uh, about the, the Momentum Lab. Let me show you how to do the, the lab with using the range finder. This is the simplest way to do it. So let me just find uh, where that is. Uh, let's see. That must be it right there. Okay, so um, this is what's going on here is that you've got, uh, the, it'll, you'll see all this noise and what you're looking for is a little spot where it levels like this, right? It catches a good glimpse of it and here's where the collision occurs. I think this is a little bitty one hitting a big one, right? Okay, and so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna select this little bit of, uh, of it. And I'm careful not to select the sides of this thing, right? I wanna use just that top like that, right? And then I'm gonna go um, and do Analyze and Statistics, right? And this is really very cool. Um, this, this thing here says uh, the minimum is 0.1646. Okay, it's got the maximum one and then it's got the mean Okay, and that's not mean like as in not nice. That's mean like as in average. Okay, so uh, and it's even, even as a standard deviation here. But for our purposes, what we're going to do is we're going to make the um, the uncertainty will be max minus min divided by two. Okay, so you can go mean, and then plus or minus max minus min divided by two. Right. So uh, let's go to uh, uh, this guy here. Right. So so basically, you're just going to use the mean value. Right? And then whatever the max is, minus the min divided by 2, that'll be your uncertainty, the uncertainty of velocity, right? And that's what you'll use for the velocity, okay? So that's the basic idea. Uh, and then you can do that. And then, of course, we, we want the, the, the stuff afterwards, right? So I'm going to grab that. Who knows what happened there, right? Okay, so analyze uh, statistics. And then it very uncleverly puts it over the... Thing there. And here it is afterwards. Here's the mean value, the max and the min, and you've got that. And then all you need to do is, um, all you need to do then is find the, uh, the masses, right? You need the masses, you need the velocity before, you need the velocity after, right? Masses of both carts. And then the masses are going to be plus or minus half of the smallest thing that you, that you measured, right? So if you're using a scale that's got a tenth of a gram, then it's five hundredths of a gram, right? If, that's, if 0.1 is the smallest thing you can read, then it's 0 0.05. Uh, you'll find the, the electronic balance is like point something something, right? So your uncertainty is 0 0.005 of a gram, right? And then these guys, you, you're going to find the uncertainty using the uh, Logger Pro software. Again, it's going to be plus or minus max minus min divided by 2, right? And then momentum is, of course, mv, right? Okay? And the uncertainty of the momentum is going to be easy, right? It's just uncertainty of mass. Whoops. Yeah? Okay? So that's the basic idea.